Her mother spent her last moments trying to save Greta. I couldn't let that be in vain. <laughs> Ew, I gotta reload it. I was coming home from a class and there was just a mouse sitting on my floor and she didn't look very well. I found Greta just sitting beside her. Her mother had tucked her in to the blankets. She wanted to keep Greta warm and safe and we're better to do that than in a sofa with some blankets. It was heartbreaking for me to see her trying so hard to save Greta. Greta's mom had a bot fly larva in her stomach. It's a large parasite that varies into their skin. Greta's mom was so small that she couldn't handle it and she passed away. Morning, sweetheart. Oh, yeah. Time to go play? Oh. She had to be fed every two hours for two weeks. And I knew that if I didn't do it, I don't think anyone else would have. I was a full-time student at the time, so it was just absolutely exhausting to care for her constantly. I even had to rub her stomach to make her go to the bathroom because she couldn't do that on her own as a baby. Hey, sweetie. It was really challenging to have a lot of people telling me that what I was doing was wrong and that they wouldn't be willing to do the same thing. And it was just a mouse. Why am I trying so hard for a mouse? I don't know. <laughs> In my opinion, not trying to save her would have been the selfish thing to do. She loved attention. She loved people. She loved sitting on your shoulder or in your sleeve. You're so sweet. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she thinks she's a human because when she first met another mouse, she did not understand what they were doing. Greta is too scared to be left alone, so I'm going to have to hold her while they meet. Oh. <laughs> she had this strange look in her eyes like, I'm adopted? <laughs> She was scared of him. She would watch him from the distance to see what he's doing. And if he came near her, she would scream and run to me to hide. And eventually, while she was sleeping, he kind of snuck in with her and fell asleep beside her. And when she woke up, they were best friends and inseparable since. Hey. Good girl. She knows her name and she loves when we talk to her. Greta. Hey. Snack. I don't have any good ones. <laughs> What a disappointed mouse. She is very independent now, but she still pays attention to me. She still watches what I'm doing. There's a misconception that they're dirty when all they want is warmth and food, just like us. And they're very clean animals. If you just touch them, they spend hours cleaning the smell of human off of them. Hey, can you come play?